It's Friday morning, April the 29th, 2022. And it's a pleasure to be able to share some principles with you from the Word of God today. I'm Pastor Mike Custer, the pastor of Bible Baptist Church in Grand Forks, North Dakota. And we're going to read and consider Proverbs chapter 23, verse 17 this morning. Proverbs chapter 23, verse 17, where the Bible says, Let not thine heart envy sinners, but be thou in the fear of the Lord all the day long. And this has to do with our focus of life. What is it that you love? What is it that you're looking toward? The Bible says don't envy sinners, and we could imagine a lot of things that that would entail. For example, people who have made the acquisition of material possessions their God, they have a lot because that's become the focus of their life. And so we look at them with an envious eye or an envious heart. How about people that go out and, and seem like they're having a good time and they're always enjoying their life and they're always filling up their life with entertainment type events. Some people envy that sort of thing. But what we don't see is the emptiness that people experience without the Lord. What we don't see is the lack of comfort and the lack of joy that people will naturally feel when they don't have the Lord as the center of their life. The Bible says don't envy sinners. Don't, don't desire what they have. Instead, um, live in the fear of the Lord all the day long. People who don't fear God, who don't know the Lord, will just focus on themselves and their life will be a very unfruitful and unsatisfying thing. And think about life itself. You know, life is full of trouble. And when a person experiences trouble, where do they go? Where do they go for help? Where do they go for reassurance? Where do they go for joy and peace if they don't know the Lord? When they experience the natural course of this life, you know, sickness and death and all this kind of thing, where do people go if they don't know the Lord? Don't envy sinners. Don't envy people that may have more stuff than you have and may seem to have uh, in some ways a more happy or joyful or celebratory life than you have. Instead, be joyful, be thankful. Never fail to appreciate the comfort and the peace and the joy that comes from knowing the Lord. Don't envy sinners. The Bible gives us this admonition, let not thine heart envy sinners, uh, but be thou in the fear of the Lord all the day long. And to know that the Lord is in charge and he sees beyond and is more powerful than all the issues of life that we may face is a great comfort when we need it the most. I think Romans 8, 28, where the Bible says that that those whose lives are in Christ's hands uh, will see the circumstances work together for good is a great comfort. It's a great joy that the Lord is overseeing and watching over all of our steps and all of our life circumstances and will bring them about for good. All things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. And that's not true for unsaved folks that everything's going to work out all right in the end and it will be for the best. What a great promise that is from a gracious heavenly father. And he has enough time and he has enough wisdom. He has enough power to oversee the affairs and the situations of your life as well. Just submit to him. Just live in the fear of the Lord. And that will be a far better way to live than any other way. Saints know this. God's people know this already. It may be pointless and moot for me even to say it. But this is what Proverbs 23 verse 17 teaches. And so don't, don't be envious of those who go a different direction. They don't have what you have if you know Christ. Praise God for his goodness and for his blessing. God bless you today.